know, it was okay. Um, you know, we couldn't really hold on to the ball, you know, as an offense, too many turnovers. But um, you know, I feel like we you know, we didn't get down on ourselves or anything like that. We were able to keep our composure and just keep grinding through the game. And blessed to come out with that win. They, they, they were out there playing. It was a great game. They played tough. The Eagles you know, did a great job out there. Um, it wasn't as much trash talking as I thought it would be, but um, you know, it was a fun game. You know, we have to respect each and every one of our opponents, no matter what division they are, what conference they in. Um, so we we know they're a good team over there. You know, like I've said before, every team has has those certain amount of guys. You know, on their team that can play this game of football. To, very high level, so you have to respect your opponent at all times and just go into this game with a good mindset and prepare. Um, just making sure you know we focus, focused in and practice. Um, just make sure you know we're doing all the right things and just prepare to the best of our ability and go out there and get a win. You know, I'm confident in all the backs we have right now. I feel like they, they're all playmakers. You know. Um, you know, things happen. You know, some some games are just not some guys' games. You know, it, it's a game of football. That's just how it goes. You know, just like for myself, I didn't have my best game, so uh, it, it, it's, it's it's football. So you just have to you know learn from it and move on to the next. And you know, I, I have confidence in all of our running backs and in our running game. I've been comfortable with, with them since day one. Uh, it hasn't changed. Um, I know those guys are, are veterans, leaders of this team, leaders of this offense. So um, I've always felt confident in them. Uh, I believe in them to the fullest. Those are my brothers. So uh, I know we're going to continue to you know, fight down the road and continue to you know, have a good season. Just our main key is just taking care of the ball, especially after that last game. Um, we, felt, we felt like we were doing a lot. A lot of right things during that game. We were able to move the ball. It was nothing really that you know we couldn't that we couldn't do. Um, just too many turnovers. We felt like we moved the ball well. All of our players were working, so um, just taking care of the ball is the main key. It was. I, I didn't expect it. I just uh, keyed on the opportunity and made the made the best of it. And so, yeah, my mind was going crazy. <laughs> and then I, I realized, like, a minute later, I had to go back out there. And so I had to get my mind right again. So it was like a high and then kind of get my mind right again, focused, you know? Oh, moving on. Yeah. Uh, I just don't pay attention to the hype. Like, you know, everyone's hitting me up on Facebook and stuff like that, but I just kind of ignore it and kind of do my daily routine and so that kind of keeps needs me. to do too to not I mean it was an emotional game obviously yeah I feel like we're all emotionally exhausted but as far as moving on to the next game uh, we're we're gonna get into a good mindset and I just barely found out so it feels good uh, I'm grateful I'm very grateful for the opportunity that I have to be this the Pac-12 player of the week so I have goals. Uh, I, I can't uh, foresee or foretell what, what happens. So as far as being surprised, like, I'm kind of surprised, you know. I just expect a lot out of myself. And so coming in this year, I, didn't, I don't want to lower my standards for anything, any goals, and try to play to my, to my potential. It's just like a blur, so I think like everything, we're, we're working on everything every day, we're, we're working on something, and so I, I can't name a specific point what, what we're working on, <laughs> but as far as the defense, uh, they get us prepared for anything that comes up. Six turnovers, oh, as far as that, uh, I, I personally like playing, you know, and so uh, as far as the turnovers went, uh, we took it head on. We didn't see it as we didn't see it as something that we can like be down about, but more of an opportunity to make more plays. As a defense. Yeah, we're we're pretty confident. There's always something you can work on. 
that 21 play drive is, is great, uh, but let's let's cap it off. Let's do another 21 play drive with a touchdown. You know, so um, you always work on something, always something to fix, and it's not always perfect, but uh, attitude and effort will you know cover most things. Up. I think as soon as this press conference is over, then it's all San Jose State. Um, and I think the team needs to fix, uh, feel the same way. I mean, be happy, you beat uh, your rivalry. It was a very emotional game, but we still have 10 games left to play this season. We have a game to win this Saturday. Um, you got to shift your focus to uh, San Jose State and kind of have short term memory. You know, great you won, uh, let's win another one. Uh, whoever's going to produce, uh, is going to play. Uh, I think we have three running backs who are going to do just fine and battle it out amongst themselves this week. And uh, whoever's going to be the guy is going to be the guy, and I'll block for whoever it is. Uh, ball security and uh, keep building on being more and more physical uh, across the board. All 11 guys got to play physical, whether it's a run or a pass, and uh, take care of football.